So, I'm doing a tea ceremony. It's very easy to do. Again, taking full responsibility though for whatever plants that you use, fully check out if they're safe to use. This is passion flower. It's an amazing healing plant and it has great qualities of healing of peace. So allowing a really different sort of feeling, it's very hard to describe, where you feel peaceful but you don't feel that any part of you is being suppressed. So on a practical level, what am I doing? Well, I've got a teapot with an infuser in it and I'm just waiting for my kettle to boil. I am working with an intention today. It's Libra Moon waxing. It's Sun in Gemini. So again, in terms of that energy, it's how to come into balance with the mind, both being air signs. In terms of the Mayan calendar, it's a very magical day. It's yellow resonant warrior today, and it's a 13 clear sign. For more information on that, check out my blog, flowwithjoe.com. The 13 day process that we're in is around becoming very aware of what conditions we've learned, what we've been conditioned to in our society and in our childhood experience in order to become the human being that we are. And once we have that awareness, how we can let go of it over time bringing it to conscious awareness and then using whatever tools we have to release it. I use emotional and freedom techniques. I find it works very powerfully. Having a tea ceremony with passion flower can help put us in a real meditation space so that we can access different information from our higher self that may be, a, you know, when our mind's getting in the way. So it's just another facilitation process. It's very ancient and it's used around the world. One of the areas it's used would have been the Mayan South America times of when the wave spells were written. Anyway, I can hear my kettle is whistling, so I'm just going to switch that off. And adding the water into the pot. So again, the intention is to raise awareness for me of where I can create more peace and let go of past life. As you can see the brush of flowers in there. So just putting it on there to infuse for a few minutes. Yeah, so I can start creating more of the new one because this time's really about that letting go of our past way of being that is no longer serving us so we can create a new way. Okay, so this is part one in the video. I am going to be drinking tea and I'll come back to you in part two later. Thank you.